Hey there, everybody. I want to share this with all of you. I really do. Rebirth Island is the new plunder in uh, Modern Warfare 2. It just came out. And what it's done is taken a whole bunch of players like before in Caldera Island and crunched this down into a tiny little island. Now, the objective of the game is whoever gets the most money wins. It's not who gets the most kills wins. So what you're going to see, it's even worse than Caldera. People are going batshit crazy trying to kill each other. So you're going to see my team that I joined for the very first time. This is my first playthrough in this game. I'm a noob. And you're going to see my game and my team go crazy. You're going to see my game build up and them guys are going to fall apart. And it's going to all be piece by piece. So here we go. I'm going to share it with you. But remember, the rules of plunder, whoever has the most money wins. So here we go. Game starting. I have not played this yet. It's my very first playthrough. So I don't have a clue what I'm doing, where I want to go, or what I want to get. I do know, however, it's plunder. And I excel at plunder. Here it goes. I'm down. I want to show my kill. i show you how many times I got killed. So from there, I'm going to move on to the next one. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to concentrate on plundering. Now I see these red circles all around me overlapping, and I can hear my team going crazy, shooting everybody. So I'm going, no, I'm not getting into this. I'm playing plunder. Because I've been playing this game too long to fall for it. Now we're the top team. So it's looking good. But still... I don't know what I'm doing. So it's on to this building. I'm going to check it out. Now I'm finding crates open, so somebody is plundering. Now I'm not even running around. I'm walking around like a drunken sailor on one leg. I'm trying to go slow in case somebody jumps me. Normally in plunder, I'm blasting through Caldera and I'm ripping out the boxes. But not in this case. I do know that everybody's getting killed out in the open. So to me, this is slow. Again, like I say, it's my first time. First time in this new plunder. But what I see is showing me a lot. Because I'm going to go back, I'll explain this as this video progresses, how I will approach this game and how what I will do. I'll make a couple more videos on the results. Now right there is a little room. I did not check it. I'm stupid. So down I go again. No big deal. You only give up a little bit of your cash. So frankly, I'm feeling I'm doing a wimpy job here. I'm hobbling around. I'm not getting much crates. And I pretty much get my butt whipped. So I'm going to show you how many times I go down. That I get shot and killed in this video. And then when you see the result, you're going to be a little stunned. Then you're going to see the team progress. Is this guy starts ranting, getting his kills, and the girl starts having fun. She starts singing. The team's the team is really having a blast. I'm not mic'd up. I'm not saying a word. I'm just slowly plundering. In plunder, cash balloon is your best friend. Try to do it in a protected area where nobody can see. I don't see any red circles coming at me, and I'm gonna put my cash up. It is the best thing you can get. Use it. If you see one, pick it up. Do not turn it away. The balloon is your best friend. Now you can hear my team getting fired up. The girl's getting excited. The guy is starting to make a lot of kills. I'm not saying anything. I don't like to make myself up when I make videos. It's not about me. It's about the game. I'm going to go on the ship. The ship had one one supply box, and that was it. So all in all, the ship is not a good spot to go. Now, by doing this, I remembered, and I'm not going back to it. But I am finding, just in this first playthrough, the honey holes that I want to come back to later. So I'm learning by one playthrough. Now, at the bottom end of the island, here's where I start to hit pay dirt. There's a bank drop here, and I know that will attract people that want to ambush you. What I'm looking for is sloppiness. Did they go in these little buildings? Did they check the little rooms? See, I'm not seeing nothing there. 
I'm gonna work my way on down. See, I'm moving faster now. I'm starting to plunder. I'm getting in the groove. I'm looking for sloppiness. I see open crates. But see there, that little building wasn't even open. That's sloppy. That's what you look for. Sloppy players that went in front of you. Now I'm starting to get ballsy. I'm sticking around. Looking for more stuff. Going to the roof. And there's one crate. See, that's how you want to be thorough. So because I've gotten a few crates, what I'm going to do since I'm near the cash drop, the bank, I'm going to put out the smoke and call it down. Now I know I'm asking for trouble because a lot of gamers love to stick around these places. And they see you calling that chopper, they're going to come running over here. But as you see, I have no red spots close to me. So I'm going for it. So I put my cash in this guy too. Now I'm feeling good. I hear my team, they sound like they're killing a lot of players. So it's looking good. Knocking on first place door, looking good. Still finding unopened doors, still finding supply boxes. I'm in the groove. I'm kicking butt. This is in a little small building. There's two of them in here. It's just crazy. There's a balloon. Now when I'm plundering, I don't pay any attention to people coming after me because it will distract you from plundering. So I'm going to get shot down. No big deal. But I just wanted to show you guys and girls how much I get shot down. Now if this was called Dara or uh, what's it called, the Ukrainian town, I would already stop because I can't get shot down this often. However, in this island, it's easy to get shut down a lot and still make a lot of money. So keep that in mind. Don't worry about getting shot down. Don't quit the game if you do. So the game is winding down to the end now. I'm kind of lost. I'm pretty much wiped out what I can get here at the south end. So here comes the cluster strike. I'm about to get nuked. He's, you can see the red circle around me in the top left of my screen. So I go down. And I mean, this is a lot of times you go down. But like I say, don't worry about it. So here it is. The game's going to end. And you're going to see what happens to my team. They're going to get shocked and they're going to shut up. You know why they're going to shut up? Because the guy that killed 20 people only made, I think, $68,000. 86000 is all he made. I made $363,000 with 11 crates and one kill. He made 20 kills. If he would have tried to get a couple of crates and stop killing people, just get five or six crates, we would have won this game. And that's what's pissing me off. And they're all mute. They're quiet. They don't know what to say. Because I played plunder and they did not. So keep that in mind, guys and girls. Do a blend of the two. Kill people and plunder. That way you'll win the game. See you in the next video.